Hi, this is Ron Martinson of ronmartblog.com. I'm here to show you the Think Tank Photo uh, Slingomatic 10 today. And this is a um, really interesting bag. Um, you have a little handle here, you have a zip pocket here, you have the big, thick, beefy zippers that Think Tank is famous for. Um, <laughs> when you open the side, there's a storage compartment. Um, there's this really nice, very soft uh, protective cover that will cover your LCD. Uh, mine's kind of sloppy right now. You can configure it nicer. Um, I have a 100 millimeter macro lens in here, and then I have a 580 EX2 flash fitting right here. And then there's room here for something else on the side, uh, like another flash, or uh, currently I have a uh, expo disc in here, um, but I could very easily put another flash in here. So um, there's plenty of room inside of it. However, um, with my 5D Mark II and the 24105, I have to have the hood in the closed position. If I put the hood on, it's actually wrong now, but that's better, in the um, on position, I can't close the bag very well. So that's something to keep in mind. I think the sling bag, the Slingomatic 20, is probably the better choice. So um, there's a little uh, handle here to grab it, and there's another handle here. Um, there's a nice top pocket, and a side pocket here, as well as close this up, side pocket here. So there's tons of storage space, despite it being a really small bag. Um, and what's really cool is it's got a really thick uh, padded um, strap here. And on the other side, there's a big pocket where you could actually put a lightweight uh, hiking tripod. Um, so um, despite its compact size, it's quite good. And this is uh, padded as well. so. Um, despite my disdain for sling bags, uh, it's really quite comfortable. So that's kind of a quick overview of the bag. Consult the article for more information.